let us spend a moment of silence and let us be aware of our almighty Father's presence for the gift of life we continuously enjoy. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Welcoming God, whose abiding love sustains our world. With glad hearts, we gather here in celebration of our shared histories. We remember the close friendships formed in our childhood with heartfelt gratitude that reaches us back through the years. We are grateful for the dedicated lives of teachers, mentors, and family members who have fostered us as we have grown. May our time together be joy-filled as we share memories of days gone by and news of where life's journey has taken us. Lord, give us the grace to recognize our mistakes from the past so that we might have forgiving hearts. May our reunions be shaped by kindness and laughter, and may the stories told and retold today bring delight and goodwill. We give thanks for the food we share today, for the hands who harvested, transported, prepared, and now serve it. And as we enjoy this meal, May our festivities be a toast in honor of and thanksgiving for those who had a part in our lives in Kampuan Elementary School over 22 years ago. Bless this reunion time. May these moments together lead us to treasure ever more fully each bit of our hearts and every new day life brings us. Make this a special day full of fun and excitement, celebrating life as we walk through the memory of our childhood. And after our great time together, grant us a safe trip back home. Even as we pray and hope to be enjoying each other's company again at our next class reunion. With the hope of God's peace in the world, for this we ask your blessing, our loving Father, through Jesus Christ, your Son. In the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God forever and ever. Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Good morning, magandang buhay, maayong buntag sa inyong mga tanan, batchmates, classmates. First and foremost, I want to thank Mahal for allowing me to send a message about the next class reunion on June 25 and 26. I would like to congratulate to all who worked so hard to make this event a success. Even if some of us can't attend, I am confident it will be a joyful and engaging time for you to share your stories. I believe this is why we need this gathering and why there will be a reunion. It is because we are thrilled to be able to share one of the most unforgettable experience or events of our lives during our elementary school. 
ang mga kwentong nakaukit sa mga puso natin. Sabi nga sa ating theme, Our past does not define our future. In other words, who you are in elementary does not define you today. Would you agree with me? Smile nga kayo kung agree kayo sa sinasabi ko. Indeed, that is true. Nobody knows what will happen to you in the future, right? You might be wondering why I am a religious sister. Why I become a religious sister. Which is the reality I am not good or kind, but rather strict. Alam kong iba't ibang kwento ng buhay natin bago natin makamit ang ating mga pangarap at tagumpay. Pero ito ang ating dapat tandaan. Naging bahagi sa ating paglalakbay ang ating mga guro na humubog at nagsakripisyo para sa atin for us to learn not only lesson but values as well. Kaya thanks to all our elementary teachers, particularly Ma'am Melba and Sir Cabandas, hindi man kami, ako, good students knew before dahil minsan pasaway, but I personally appreciated well your patience, presence, and understanding for our growing life. <laughs> Medyo mahaba na, 10 minutes lang ang hiningi sa akin ni Mahal. Siguro I will go directly to what we need to ponder. Isa sa mga pinaka napagnilayan ko at gusto kong ibahagi sa inyo ay ang kot ang hindi marunong lumingon sa pinanggalingan ay hindi makakarating sa paruluunan. Let us remember that our past is the part of our present and future. Let this gathering be a renewal of our friendship. Sharing of experiences in this challenging world. Alam kong makulay ang buhay ng bawat isa. From the different vocation we have chosen. Some are blessed to be single. Kaway-kaway naman kayo dyan. Most in married life. Pumalakpak na kayo. And yours truly in religious life. Magdadasal na ba ako? Indeed, life is about relationship. Kung wala tayong kaibigan, mga kasama, life would be meaningless. We know when we enter into a relationship. It requires commitment. And this commitment demands faithfulness and sacrifices to achieve our dream. My commitment to God is to be involved with the youth, music ministry, and teaching in our school. Alam kong mayroon din kayong kanya-kanyang commitment. It would be in your husband, or in your wife, or in your children. But I do hope that in the end, you are faithful to your commitment. So as we remember all those years, let us thank the faithfulness of God who always there to guide our journey. Maaaring madaming nagbago sa atin in sizes, shape, and age, at kahit sa school natin. But one thing for sure, our memories during those years remain. Thank you and enjoy this moment as we celebrate, you celebrate the renewal of our friendships. God bless us all. Ladies and gentlemen, me, I present to you, class of 2000 graduates of Camp 1 Elementary School. Let's start with Grade 6 Anthorium under the advisory of Mr. Hermanali S. Cabanlas. <laughs>
Now, we have here, from Grade 6 Kathlia, Advisor, Mrs. Melba C. Arteta. Sana all lang ni. Bye-bye. Maayong hapon, kanatong tanan. Dako ang akong pagpasalamat sa nagpasiyugda ni Inning atong BATS reunion. Dako akong kalipay nga kita nagkaiusa bisan ang atong ubang kabats anaa sa layong dapit. Sa akong pagkakita sa inyong mga 
maanyag nga hulagway di malikayan ang dakong kamingaw unta sa inyong pagtapok-tapok amo magmalipayon og yar ko taman dagang salamat sa gugmang way pagluban thank you